What's going on, everybody? It's your boy. Welcome to Fat Boy Fragrance, of course. Let me turn my hat around, baby. Welcome to Fat Boy Fragrance, of course. I'm Mr. Fat Boy, and today we got it's Thursday Throwdown, baby. Two heavyweights going at it today on a fragrance that both of them are. This was requested by a couple people. So, you know, when your boy gets a request, he delivers on it. All right, so what we're doing today is a throwdown. We'll get all up in here in a minute. But right now, first of all, I want to say if you're new to my channel, boy, did you pick a day. It's Thursday throwdown. Whoo! Welcome. So come on and hit that like and subscribe. Join the Fat Boy family because if you like a place of positivity, of energy, and somebody who always brings it, it's your boy. All right. Thank you for the support. Thank you for supporting me at FatBoyFragrance.com. That's how I keep this game going. You know, your boy does not take freebies. He earns everything. He pays for everything. And I supplement it through FatBoyFragrance.com. Thank y'all for being so supportive. Don't forget about the huge, huge Memorial Day sale we got going on right now. Check it out. Email me or message me. However you have to get a hold of me if you have any questions, baby. Because you know what I say. The customer is always right. Take care of the customer. All right. Today we're doing Dua against Parfums Vintage, baby. Woo! Some feelings going to get hurt on this one. And some people aren't going to be happy. Because there's some passionate, passionate uh, side people on both sides of this. So, but this was requested because people don't want to compare these two. They're so close together. And, 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 and they, they're doing the same thing. They want to know which one is the better one to buy. I'm going to let you know today and just throw down. So let's get all up in it, baby. And you know how we do it. No salad, no dessert. Just straight steak and beans, baby. Fat Boy Fragrance Review starts now. What you know about that green jelly, baby? Bet you haven't heard this song in a while. I used to play this song for my kids. They love this song, man. All right, so the battle today. Y'all ready? Parfums Vintage So Extract against Dua Fragrances Supernova a tar, boy. Little pig, little pig, let me in. Makes me want to fight, not the pigs. All right, let me roll up my sleeves a little bit. Y'all ready to get all up in this? All right. So, before we get started, I'll explain both fragrances. These are clones of Elysium from Rosa Dove. But these are claimed by both companies to be amped up versions. Like 50% more concentrated, way amped up. So, in essence, they should last longer than the originals. And last longer than their first versions of these. Duas just came out, Supernova Atar, this past couple weeks ago. So Extract's been out for about two months. So they're fairly new. So everybody's kind of curious about it. Which one's better? I've worn them both. I'm going to break this down basically. Compare smells. And then see which one lasts longer. And we'll call it a winner. It's plain and simple. This shouldn't take long. Because I've already got my feelings of which ones last longer. Just going to share with y'all now. Alright. So we're going to spray Parfums Vintage on. Let's make sure we get this right. Because I had an issue with one video back in the day. So I got my arms confused. Thank you for pointing that out. I'm going to make sure we get the right arm so we get the exact correct uh, result here. Okay, so Parfums Vintage is going on the watch hand. Do it will go on this hand. We're going to also spray Vintage up here and do up here. So we got a good distribution all the way around. All right, let's go ahead and spray. One spray a piece. That's it. Only one and one up here. All right, man. Here we go. We'll do, do it the same way. One spray. Well, I missed. There we go. One spray there for Dua. 
and one spray there, that's it. All right. Now, let's compare them. Let's take a look at the bottle. Man, this one's leaking or something. There's an issue with this one bottle of Parfums Vintage. It has leaked a little bit. I need to reach out to him about that. But there's Parfums bottle. Let me clean it off a little bit. There it is right there. You can get a good look at it. Solid bottle in it. We're not going to compare bottles today. I think Parfums got to do a beat. It's not fair to put that in as, as, as a competitor. It's about the juice on this one. And there's Dua's. So there they both are. This comes in 100 ml or 50. This one comes in a 30 ml. These are both available for sampling at the FatboyFragrance.com store. Support your boy. The customer is always right. Okay, so let's put it down. Let's compare initial smells. Dua. All right. Parfum Vintage. So, on the opening, Dua's is a little bit stronger, but smells not as good. Does that make any sense? Where I feel like Parfums Vintage smells better, but not as strong. Doesn't mean it doesn't last longer. It's just that the opening seems like Dua's has more of a punch. Now, when you compare wrist, you can see that Dua's is a lot more oily than Parfums Vintage is. Dua's fragrances are a, lot, a little bit more oily. It doesn't mean they have higher oral concentrate. This means the process they use makes them a little more oily. And that's fine. So as I smell Dua's, and I smell Parfums Vintage, and I'm comparing them, I'm going to spray them one more time on the wrist on each. So we get a, another whiff of them. All right? Dua on the non-watch arm. We'll spray them twice. Just to make sure we got them everywhere so we'll know that this is a fair decision here, okay? Parfums Vintage twice. All right. We'll let them air out for a second. I love this part. I love this video. I remember this video. This video was really cool. Okay, here we go. Parfums Vintage. Okay, now, and pretty much, here's the deal. There's not much difference in similarity. They're similar. They're pretty much the same fragrance. It's like, doesn't, do it, probably smells a little bit off compared to perfumes, but not by much. It's not enough to make a difference. The average nose would not know the difference between these two. Here's where they separate. Is in performance. That's what matters. These are supposed to be amped up fragrances. <laughs> a little bit lit biscuit, baby. Here's where they here's where they differ. So let's just go ahead and get it out of the way. Which one lasts longer? I heard somebody say I sprayed it on my pants and it lasted like uh, three days. Okay, I get it. This is skin. I wore it on skin and on clothing for two days to get my feelings on it. So I one and a half days. On my off day, I wore it in the morning, wore one, changed clothes, sprayed that one, put it on again, set the clothes aside separate and smelled them in about three hours later and pretty much was able to come to a pretty much a solid conclusion on this. So let's recap before we bring that up. Do was a little bit more stout, not by much, in the opening, stronger. Parfums Vintage smells a little bit better. Which one overall lasted longer? The bottle I pick up wins, and I'll explain why. Don't get your feelings hurt. This is my skin. This was my performance. I don't have anything to do with either company. Y'all know your boys. Always honest. So Extract. Beat Dua. Not by a lot, man. We're talking maybe a couple hours. Three minutes, two hours. Let's say it lasted two hours longer than Dua's. On the clothing, it was closer. I could still smell Parfums Vintage more. Now, to make up for Dua's crappy sprayer, I did spray Dua one extra time. 
to make it fair. On the skin, Parfums Vintage easily won it by two hours. I would say it was about an hour difference on the on, on the clothing. It wasn't a huge difference. Is that enough to really either one? Eh. I like them both. I don't mind either one of them. And this one's fairly leaking, man. I gotta get this one fixed. It's leaking bad. All right, so I'm gonna get that one out of my hand. I'm gonna smell like some good stuff when I go to bed at night. <laughs> so, in finishing, congratulations to Parfums Vintage. You won the battle of the hyped up Supernova fragrance. Not Supernova, but Elysium Clone fragrance. So Extract is a little bit stronger by a couple hours on the skin. On the clothing, it's about an hour difference. They both smell great. Do is a little bit not as good smelling as, say, Vintage smells better in the opening by a little bit, but Dua is a little... Boy, I love this song. It's one of my favorite songs in the world. Bullet with Butterfly Wings from Smashing Pumpkins is a beautiful song. Bam! Mm. So, to finalize everything here, okay? And I feel bad both ways, man. I'm not trashing Dua. Y'all know me. I, I, I love Dua's. I love Parfums Vintage. I love everything I have in my collection. If I don't like it, I don't have it. I sell it. Or if it's an oud, I keep it for somebody who wants to buy oud. Freaking oud. But they're both worth it. Somebody asked for this, and I did the video. It was a good throwdown. It was fun to do to really break down the fragrances with clothing and skin to get my full feelings on it. But Parfums Vintage So Extract is stronger overall than Dua's version Supernova Tarn. Not by a lot. They both smell great. That's all the time I got. Congratulations, Parfums Vintage. You're the winner of this throwdown, baby. Any suggestions for throwdowns, y'all let me know. Y'all stay safe. Y'all stay well, baby. And you know what I always tell you. If you smell good, baby, and you feel good, you know it's going to be all good. Fatboy Fragrance Reviews is out.